I haven't been up here in a while. I'm getting the rust off me. Uh, so I have a bit of an eating problem, according to a 13-year-old ex expert in my comment section. So, uh, <laughs> But did you hear about the big fat balloon? He really let himself go. <laughs> <laughs> so at least I'm not as fat as that. I do like deep fried anything though, as long as the fries are deep fried. <laughs> and those fries will be. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's for the best that I go on a diet. Dead people are the best uh, at diets. I'll have to ask them. Dead people are always on diets. <laughs> 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 uh, so, yeah, so you don't die. The doctor uh, advised me by saying about uh, some kinds of uh, flat bread are actually healthy for you. So, I bought some white bread and I ran over it with my car. <laughs> there we go, flat bread. It's healthy now. Yeah. <laughs> You know, preparing food is hard. I don't envy farmers with all their hard work that they do. I, I had this neighbor that had a farm, and one time, all the chunk, uh, the chunks of corn fell out of his wagon. Uh, all he did was tell me that uh, he'll play it by ear. <laughs> I was running low on food, uh, so I thought, why not get a job? around food. It was a dream that turned into Israel and Pakistan. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> we ran out of uh, we ran out of straws in the back and one coworker really didn't want to hear that so he shouted, That's a lot of straw and he he walked out. <laughs> uh, that coworker was me. <laughs> I really have trouble keeping jobs. I'll tell you all about it. <laughs> I ditched a ditch digging job because I, I couldn't dig it, physically or metaphorically. No, 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 that's not the end of the video, guys, don't worry. I also, <laughs> I also was an attorney for a really long time once. I called it an in, internity in as an attorney. <laughs> but the worst job was the, being a charge nurse. And I was just doing my job and I got fired. You know, how can you be a charge nurse and not charge into rooms like Kramer from Seinfeld? Come on. It's a comedic touch to such a such a boring place, I tell you what. I was really welcomed uh, I was really weakened for for I <laughs> really weakened for the weekend after that. <laughs> Now, I have trust issues and indecisiveness with any decision now. I tell people I need to speak to the manager, even though someone was asking <laughs> how their day, you know, even if someone was asking, you know, how their day was, just I, I need to speak to the manager before giving an opinion. <laughs> but um, most of the time, uh, no one... Uh, cares what you have to say, uh, but it still scares me. <laughs> I'll just walk away after every decision, though. I'm, t I'm, t I'm telling you, man, I really struggled with jobs. I tried being a caregiver, but I didn't care, so I got fired. Oh, bestie. <laughs> I was on the elevator and had an argument with uh, <laughs> my, my manager. I, I wasn't I wasn't checking up on my patients, so uh, he just, he didn't like that. I, I didn't care. You could say that the argument on an escalator escalated quickly. <laughs> Finally, I'm like, forget this. Let's just yawn at this guy's performance. <laughs> Finally, I'm like, forget this. I'm working at home. Then I realized I hated homework as a kid. Why do it as an adult? Thanks for listening. Donate to me in Bitcoin uh, on my MySage page. I won't call my unemployment. And thanks, Chelsea, for the notebook. Thanks. Yay, Bestie!